Hello, today I am going to show you the very simplest way how you can identify or find outliers in SPSS. Uh, now I have uh, this SPSS data. I have uh, entered into this interface from my questionnaire. Consider that these are my questionnaires. Here are the demographic information of my questionnaires and the state equations with five Likert scale level uh, strongly disagree one two disagree three neutral four agree five strongly disagree i have already entered into excel and this is my excel data and then uh, imported into my spss uh, uh, interface uh, therefore here uh, you can see that I have already uh, encoded all things here. There are two menus, data view and variable view. I hope you know that. If you don't know, just go to my uh, other uh, videos. I will put under the description bo box below. Uh, so that is it. Today, uh, how you can identify uh, the outliers in the SPSS, I will show you. When you say outliers, outliers are the out of range numbers. Uh, for example, here I have female, for gender, female and male, for female, one, for male, two. If there are numbers out of these one and two that are uh, outlier, outliers, okay? Let's say three, four, or five that are outliers. Uh, for age variable, I have how many categories five categories if i go to my study questionnaire and show you for uh, age there are five categories this one two three four five i have given one for this two for this three for this uh, one two three four five so five uh, labels if there are Numbers out of this range, six, seven, or etc., that are the outliers. For the other uh, demographic variables, the same is true. Let's say, for example, for uh, marital status, there are five categories single, in a relationship, married, widowed, and divorced. Don't divorce. That is, no, I don't like that. Uh, education level. Uh, I have how many categories here? There are seven from uh, primary co school completed up to PhD uh, completed. Uh, for uh, work experience, uh, here I have six categories. My uh, number of ranges one to six. If the, there is a number which is out of this, that is an outlier. Uh, for the steady questions, uh, in, for the questionnaires, I have used the five label Likert scale. So I have given one for strongly disagree, uh, two for disagree, up to five for strongly agree. So my num range of number is from one to five. If there are numbers out of this, that numbers are the outliers. Uh, how you can analyze uh, the outliers? Go to analyze descriptive statistics then go to explore then choose your uh, variable you want to analyze at uh, a moment let me analyze gender for example so select gender then click this and then it will be here then now gender is selected then click ok then this is the output uh, uh, page on this page go to this table simply go to this table then look at the variable is gender and uh, directly go to minimum and the maximum the minimum is one the maximum is two there is no uh, outliers uh, here that is correctly encoded let me uh, delete this one i don't want to save this one no for let me commit for example a mistake now here for gender let me type uh, three 
and let me analyze uh, analyze them descriptive statistics then explore uh, gender is already selected then okay here go to this table and now look at here one is minimum no problem the maximum is three here that is there is no three in the uh, data so that is mistake so i have to go to my uh, steady questionnaire sheet and correct this okay uh, this is for the respondent number one id number is one that indicates the respondent number one the respondent number one i can find this from my steady questionnaire sheet i have already uh, given a code id number one for my uh, steady questionnaire so i have to go to there and correct that one uh, actually we know that i have changed two to three i can easily correct now you can do it in that way let me add you uh, one more example uh, let me commit a mistake for a steady question uh, for example for question number one let me uh, type here uh, six for example this is five let me use the respondent number two and uh, the response was five let let us consider that i have typed six instead of five because five and six are uh, two side of each other on the keyboard that that is the the major source for committing the mistake let me type six here this is considered that this is out of the uh, the range that, that this number is an outlier so let me analyze uh, now uh, analyze then discrete statistics and explore uh, let me choose question number one then uh, let me uh, transfer to this and let me say okay uh, go to this table then minimum is one maximum is six my like likert scale is one to five there is no number six that is uh, a mistake so i have to go to my respondent uh, which respondent uh, the second respondent id number two uh, so i have to go to that uh, sheet and then that individual responded five six i mean five one two three i have to go to there okay when i uh, do my uh, data i do on my data okay that is all uh, if you want uh, more examples please uh, comment and uh, i can add uh, very simple this this way is very simple there are other meters okay the box meter and the other meters uh, for example by going to uh, following the, the same procedure and going to uh, the output uh, page this page you can look at this box and also you can analyze the outliers uh, but uh, the thing is which i have shown you is very very simple so use that one